This is the voltage divider circuit. Whenever you have two resistors in series, um, you can use the voltage divider equation to find out what the output voltage is at this particular point in our circuit. Okay, so this is the equation. So it's the uh, it's V out equals V in um, R two over R one plus R two. So when we plug our values in, we can see that uh, we will have uh, fifteen volts at this point here. Now, just by knowing that little bit of information, we could therefore say that the voltage drop across R one will have to be five volts. Okay, and the voltage drop across R two is uh, fifteen volts. Okay, <clears throat> so just to um, check on that. Um, all you do is you find the total resistance in our circuit, which is 8 ohms, and then you find the total current, which is 2.5 amps. So the voltage drop across R1, um, it therefore is 5 volts, and the voltage drop across R2 is therefore 15 volts. So that uh, checks out, okay? And that's um, pretty much all you need to know about the voltage divider circuit, okay? So this is our voltage divider circuit that we were looking at earlier. So if clicking our voltage button, you can see that um, we start off with 20 volts and 5 volts set drop across this R1 resistor. So the output voltage, therefore, at this point in our circuit is 15 volts. Okay. Um, our current is, therefore, going to be 2.5 amps uh, throughout our circuit. Okay. So that um, corresponds with um, the results that we got earlier. Okay. So um, that confirms it. Okay.